Was, uh, what I was mean, what was the whole story like? What all happened? Because I know you. Well, I was paying rent. Yeah. Remember? And then, sure. Okay. And every time I give him money to pay rent every month, what uh, would happen uh, was he was turning around using it for drugs. Sure. So come to end of it, then I see an eviction every three months. Mm -hmm. Right up seven. Right up seven. Oh, three. We're checking the unit. Copy. Checking seven oh three. Police department. Oh, this is exactly how I left it when I did the uh, vacancy check. Yeah, light on you? Yeah. What is all of that? Is that just dirt? Ooh, it looks, it looks like, like feces. Let me get in there. I think there's a little bit of poo. Oh, man. Good times. Tenant just texted us and told us that, uh, they ordered some DoorDash and the driver ran over their mailbox. I can hear the demons call when they do what they do. And now I feel like taking off, find a place with a view. The pain is never gonna. Gary, you getting the door count? <laughs> That's, I think, specifically for the, the down unit. Yeah. So we should just be looking there. Down specific one too, looks like? Oh, yeah, I believe so. Let's see. Damn, dude, they do have a lot of shit up here. I always forget you guys stage everything before it goes down. So I was like yeah, waiting for someone to come around the corner with stuff, and I was like, "Oh, I don't think they're coming." No, hey, you're good. Takes less time. It's smarter. We're smarter, not harder, right? Yeah. And it costs you all less. Well, that's fair. Up and down, up and down. And it takes all day. Yeah. That's more money, yeah. Go down, catch a little, go down. It's a good strategy. So pack it all, then go down. If I'm in the way, you can just not. boot me wherever you need to get out of the way. Yeah. Um, I think these empty bags are it. Give me that. How about that? You got a new vehicle, huh? You're not driving the Ford Escape that's falling apart no more. It's going to be the door further down on the right hand side down there. The steps that have completely collapsed. Yeah. Man, that's the problem. It's cold. It's a little chilly. Sitting in there for too long. Oh, that's new. You can do around here. You can see. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, he's just gonna crush the. Yep. No, no. I was getting you. Don't tell me. Tell, no, the tell screws. Me. No, I'll just pop it out. Yeah. Oh, what, what was you saying? Bruh. Hey, I have nothing more to say, man. Okay, case closed. Right. He's been doing this a long time. I mean, 34 years. 34 years. Yeah, yeah. He's seen every kind of lock there is. the hell up. Like, really bad. <laughs> Hello, Bayless. Trying to, trying to pop all the pins.
Is it empty? Oh, man. So, a lot of the time we're, we get property managers who are just like some chick they send or whoever, like not that experienced. And, um, and he comes in handy like that constantly. But, but when he was like, I could tell he was uh, like, uh, he wanted to jump up. And I was like, I was like no, these are, these are real property managers here that do this shit every day, you know. And, uh, yeah. And, uh, but but I, I mean, this is, I mean, yeah, that was impressive, right? Eight. That was and impressive. 34 years, and you can't. You can't beat it. Can't beat that. that was Here, let me show you something. Save you a little bit of time. No, a little bit of time. You did it like immediately. <laughs> well, it also was also one of the cheapest locks I've ever seen in my life. Was, the like, fact yeah, that you didn't bash uh, every pin. Or not, man. I, that was like 10 seconds and that thing fell, fell in two pieces. On the, uh, yeah, appliances should be ours, yep. Yeah, just the, uh, the fridge and the stove. You guys, the owners? Nice. Manage it. Managers, okay, because yeah, people been staying in the basement. Yeah, the guy came out the other day, stole his van. My dad lives right there, and I left the key, and I went one minute, jumped into the car. The cops found it in five minutes. Again, you gotta do something, man. That's yeah, what we're here trying to clear it out. Great, God bless you, man. Thank you. Stole the fucking van. What a real piece of shit. Ballsy. Right? See you looking as ashy as me today. Yeah, I am actually. <laughs> but I don't give a fuck. Me neither. Because that's how you know we washed our ass. That's why I'm asking. Clean? Right. Oh, she's right here. Hey, Ash! Why would you say you live in my apartment? You didn't say that. Because you know it's a lot. This is my daughter's apartment. And I pay the rent every month. She ain't lacking on shit. And when uh, if, when we put a lock on there, we're gonna give you a key. I know. And but they, that key and can't be that key. You see that? I didn't even know they broke the lock. Cause I I had a key two weeks ago. But I need the key now for. Right. But we're yeah. gonna put a lock on there, and we're That's gonna, we're gonna give it to you. That's when I started the butcher knife. And uh, took a lot of bugs out, hoping they. Cause it'd be dark in the motherfucker. Yeah, who wants to hang out in the dark? Mm -hmm. Who knows? Alright, well so far we're well under, uh... Wow. Yeah. Right now we are. Let's see. Let's see what the uh, upward horizon has for us. Hello, how you doing this morning? Good, who are you? I'm James, uh, I'm the owner of Holton Wise. We got your house last month. Obviously you know who we are, we've been talking to you like all last month, you know what I'm talking about? No. Like, you know how you're living in the house and like you aren't paying your rent and since we took over your house, you uh, haven't given us the money? No, that should be paid. No. You paid that. No, no, so if you didn't, um, and like I've had my staff call you for like literally the last three and a half weeks, and you have not been paying it. I mean, it's ringing a bell. No, okay, so I have three kids, three kids that I need to take care of. And my baby daddy, he should be home soon. Right. We had to kick him out. Right, right. But I'm not, I'm not really interested in him uh, because the issue is the lease. He's not on the lease, so like. I don't know what you guys had going on with like the old landlord, but like the least that we have when we bought your house is, is just you. So I'm, I'm just here talking to you right now, and I've had my staff contacting you like for like three freaking weeks. And that, every time you talk to them, I get it. Like you're a mom, you got kids, but like none of that matters to me. I left you a little pathway, so. Oh, thank you. Don't feel as though you boxed in for yeah. hours. All right. Yeah, I'm gonna sneak by and. Um, I 
think once we stage in this hallway, then we can push down because we're kind of full in the kitchen. This will be a long, long little afternoon for you guys. Oh. That's the only one. Really? Really? Yeah. Oh, wow. Because they were so, yeah. They might have more, but yeah, this is... He said they had the seven for the city. I'm surprised they only got one. Yeah. Because usually we have the majority in there. Oh, well, we got a bag? Are you pushing? Yeah, because I just left a little walkway. Okay. You know what, Ann? Everything light. I'm going to let you stay and pass to me. Okay. Okay. Richard, you can go on down. Then I'm going to be halfway. First impressions. Oh god damn it stinks. God damn. Got on my light. Oh my god. Oh Jesus. Well. I wish I could describe to you the smell, but it's a, uh, uh, woo, spooky room. Oh, hold on. Fuck those. Oh, shells. Cool. Police Department. Radio 703, we're checking the unit. Copy, checking 703. Police Department. I have to take a look. I don't oh, think. Yeah, yeah I, I haven't been. Think, uh, not much in there, but a mess. Make sure you, you lean good the other way. Yeah. Are they? Oh my gosh! Yeah, I already see. Holy crap! Who put these stairs up? If you look at the cracking right here. You can see it's pulling away. Wow. We'll have that. Hold up. There's my original notice from like months and months and months, and months ago. Well, I'm damned. And I took the one out there too. That was upstairs when I come in, I just click it on the side over here. Mm -hmm. See, that was for my sake. Mm -hmm. I don't blame you. Because my granddaughters play down there. Because that's where they like to play. And not. Uh, but since these motherfuckers been coming in, oh no, I'm not in the basement, um, hot tea. They be lying to me. But yeah. no, I want you to know, set the record straight, they don't live in apartment one. Okay. Angel Is that the man that like the cans? Because I got two bags of cans up there for him. He'll wind up. You know, I, I know a lot of these people, and you know my heart goes out for him. Actually, all. Got my flashlight. I did. There's that other lock that used to be right here. I guess there's two, like, I collect 
I was like, just living down here for a little while. I helped my mom out upstairs. And uh, I've been cleaning the basement, but it's like, it looks like a mess, but it was all clothes on top of this before. So it was even worse. A lot of it is stuff that she had stored down here. Okay. They just like ripped it apart, you know, so I'm trying to pick it up, clean it, and take care of it. I just have to sweep this right now. And canvas. But I helped take care of the, um, I don't I call it mom, but that, that brought us there. Okay. Right, let's check this out. We were just like, we were literally just fighting at the U-Haul place. Like literally, like, I'm putting my hands on a man that I know I can't beat. Like seriously. Like, Who's that? My baby's father. I'm like, ah, just drive, go to Lakewood. I don't want you to leave, you know? Mm -hmm. I'm like, I was so mad. I'm like, they fucked up my U-Haul. Oh. Get me shot out of the car, I know it's heavy. Oh no, I'm, I'm emotional, yeah I am, but I know how to control it after a little bit, you know? Sure. Yeah, do I want to go through the ceiling? Yes, I fucking do, <laughs> but sure. you know. I know, it sucks. Uh, it was, uh, what, was, mean, what was the whole story? Like, what all happened? Because I know you... Well, I was paying rent, Yeah. remember? And then, sure. Okay, and every time I give him money to pay rent every month, what uh, would happen uh, was he was turning around using it for drugs. Sure. So come to end of it, then I see an eviction every three months. Mm -hmm. So that's when I go and drop the twenty one hundred dollars or the eighteen hundred, and you guys see. Yeah. And you know what? Because it would be I'm, like three months of rent, is what you're saying. Yeah. So you, you see what? I, if you go back and look at the paperwork, I was I was doing it because Katie, the one that you know, Katie and Rob, mm -hmm. uh, Katie went and got a five year restraining order on him because mm -hmm. I guess he was obsessive or whatever but i've known him since i was little so i'm like all right let me i have nowhere to go let me help you blase my mom just passed away you know so i'm like okay not knowing the situation i got myself in hey, we My bad, apparently I'm wrong. Sorry about that, it's my fault. So I wonder if they gave us, uh, maybe they mislabeled them thinking that those were the keys for. I'm smelling. Uh, yo, it's mostly poop. It's cool. <laughs> <laughs> oh man! <coughs> oh, the toilet. Yeah. <coughs> I almost threw up. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that stove is ours. So the only thing in here that really needs to be taken out is the couch, right? Maybe the bed frame, I guess. I guess. The rest Vince. I get to redo the lock because I didn't know that basement door was open slash there. I didn't know there was a door at the top of the steps. Uncover all the windows. You got gloves on, right? Yeah. Okay, good, because that's the only reason I didn't do it. It looked like there was a lot of rope shit on them. I know she left her ID. I was trying to pick it up. You see under by your left foot there on the inside? Do you see that nice little weed pen they left? Oh, this thing? Yep. Yeah. Which is a cheap internet one. It's a head pen. Not that I would know anything about that. No, that's just a thing I heard about. It's a thing I heard about on the internet. And I took the one out there too. It was upstairs when I come in, I just click it on the side over here. Mm -hmm. See, that was for my sake. Mm -hmm. I don't blame you. Because my granddaughters play down there. Because that's where they like to play. And not. But since these motherfuckers been coming in, oh no, I'm not in the basement, um, hot tea. They be lying to me. But yeah. no, I want you to know, 
Set the record straight. They don't live in apartment one. Angel. Is that the man that likes the cans? Because I got two bags of cans up there for him. He'll wind up. You know, I, I know a lot of these people. And you know, my heart goes out for him. Especially all of them. There's that other lock that used to be right here. I guess there's, hold on one second. I guess there's two, like, I feel like, that lady's living down here for a little while. I helped my mom out upstairs. And uh, obviously in the basement, but it's like, it looks like a mess, but it was all closed on top of this before. So it was even worse. A lot of it is stuff that she had stored down here. Okay. They just like ripped it apart, you know, so I'm trying to pick it up, clean it, and take care of it. I just have to sweep this right now. And canvas. But I helped take care of the, I don't know, well, I call it mom, but that, that brought us there. Okay. Right, let's check this out. We were just like, we were literally just fighting at the U-Haul place. Like literally, like, I'm putting my hands on a man that I know I can't beat, like seriously. Like, Who's that? My baby's father. I'm like, ah, just drive. Go to Lakewood. I didn't want you to leave, you know? Mm -hmm. I'm like, I was so mad. I'm like, they fucked up my U-Haul. Oh, they get me shot out of the car. I know it's heavy. Oh, no, I'm, I'm emotional. Yeah, I am, but I know how to control it after a little bit, you know? Sure. Yeah, do I want to go through the ceiling? Yes, I fucking do, <laughs> but, sure. you know? I know, it sucks. Uh, it was, uh, what, was, mean, what was the whole story? Like, what all happened? Because I know you... Well, I was paying rent, Yeah. remember? And then, sure. Okay, and every time I give him money to pay rent every month, what uh, would happen uh, was he was turning around using it for drugs. Sure. So come to end of it, then I see an eviction every three months. Mm -hmm. So that's when I go and drop the twenty one hundred dollars or the eighteen hundred, and you guys see. Yeah. And you know what? Finally, it would be I, like three months of rent, is what you're saying. Yeah. So you, you see would... what? I, if you go back and look at the paperwork, I was I was doing it because Katie, the one that you know, Katie and Rob, mm -hmm. uh, Katie went and got a five year restraining order on him because mm -hmm. I guess he was obsessive or whatever but i've known him since i was little so i'm like all right let me i had nowhere to go let me help you blase my mom just passed away you know so i'm like okay not knowing the situation i got myself in yep yeah. yep 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 yeah. well it's like they purposely move things into the way so there's that Nope. What's that? No, huh? Yeah, we were thinking. Yeah, most likely. Damn, look at that fucking thing. <laughs> Hard to tell what was like left behind and what's new. It's never been this dirty down here. Yeah, well, yeah, I know, I know a lot of this. I don't know what these are. I don't know if this is... You got sheets up here to divide off the room if they were sleeping in here or something. Because I bet you, I can almost guarantee it, that that lady's probably charging her a hundred bucks just to live down here without, you know, I won't say anything, but you got to give me a hundred bucks to live down there. You know, we can go outside for a bit. Regroup. How you guys doing? You guys are about to fix one up? No, we're there with the managers. No. Just, we just got a report. There's a lot of people kind of squatting in here. Yeah, we kicked out the squatters and we're going to add a lock, but... Holton Wise. The Holton Wise. We're the property managers. We don't own the property. We're just the property managers. Yeah, we, uh, we kicked you out yesterday. The guy just drove by said that somebody stole a van and you guys found him like five minutes later. Yeah. Well, one of the squatters is that we kicked out yesterday is walking down there with a the big EMS bag. Yeah, yeah. We, that's, that's one we kicked out and we're waiting for his girlfriend. He's in the basement still? Yeah. <laughs> Do not enter police order. Uh, I guess they did get a uh, notice that said that they were being evicted, so I guess that counts as police order. Well, this is exactly how I left it when I did the uh, vacancy check. Yeah, light on you? Yeah. What is all of that? Is that just dirt? Ooh, it looks, it looks like, like feces. Let me get in there. I think there's a little bit of poo. Talking about the empty one. Uh, 
me clear this room out quick. Here's a better look at that stain. It's a burn hole. Shoot. Well, he just showed up and like knocked the window out on you or something no, like that. No, he came up here it's with the cops and I'm like, the cops came around, I'm like, what's going on? I was cooking dinner. I was like, what's going on? And the cops yeah. were like, uh, he wants to get his car out of here. I was like, number one, my, that the car couldn't move the Sentra mm -hmm. because I was in an accident. Mm -hmm. So I had to get investigated and all this stuff, you know? Mm -hmm. So um, after that, then um, I'm like, well, I could get towed out of here or pushed out of here. But uh, he put the desk in the BMW. I said, I got all the paperwork in the car. You want it? But what were you going to do with it? That's how bad it was. Yeah. I mean, literally, that's how bad it was. I'm like, like, what kind of drugs are you on, dude? I could see somebody smoking pot or something. But when you're stealing from people and stealing, yeah, sure. You know, it, it's habit. worse than that, dude. Yeah. You know, and uh, I, I have 11 kids, you know, and God, don't take from me. You know, I'd help anybody in a heartbeat, but those ain't even on our table. Like, it might be yours now if you want them. I know. <laughs> Maybe they're bad vibes, though. You know? Yeah. I mean, I'm taking. Um, <laughs> only the bottom two pieces come off. The glass on the bottom two pieces, which I wish you take off. Like, just lift it up. Put your hand underneath and lift it up. Yeah, take it off. So you've been here, but you know where the basement is? Is it a uh, common man, access? Or I don't is think it, it has common access. It's through that middle unit, or there's a back door. I'll shut for the basement. Yeah, back on the door. Yep. Wait, the PIN number? Uh, 303. Oh shit, there's a fucking door. Oh, there was a door here. And like, oh, they probably rented it when it looked like the. Ew. I know, that flytrap did the Lord's work for God only knows how long. You get me. I put it on this one so that I can forget about it and back into it. Some poopy stained undies. Hell yeah, dude. That's happy. Right as I said that, we stopped filming. Look at those nice shit stained fancy underwear. So you for ten bucks. Ten bucks. Ten bucks for fully saturated underwear. What do you think this is it's supposed to be a scarf? Oh wait, it's actually like a lot of stuff. Yeah, it's like this lady crochet. Not very good. All her shit's fucking tangled. Stupid. <laughs> Stupid idiot. Is this the art you're talking about? Yeah. Hell yeah. I think that's the doll from the Rugrats. I know. I was going to say that. I can think of the name. <laughs> it looks just like... It's fucking perfect, dude. I'll leave that right there for now. I am real curious about what's in the box, though. What's in the box? We can snoop. Yeah, I feel like we should. Uh, I mean, we're here, man. Yeah. Oh, it's heavy too. Oh, please don't be a dead animal. I'll be real upset. Is that just water? I think it's a box of water. You want a box of water? water? You want to pull it up for me? So I can get your live reaction. It smells bad. It does smell really bad. Uh, oh, it's a dog bed. It's a dog bed covered in water. Who does that? I don't know. When I, when I pinched it open a little bit, I saw the brown and was like, oh no, it is a dog. Oh man, good times. Tenant just texted us and told us that uh, 
they ordered some DoorDash and the driver ran over their mailbox. Yeah. <gasps> yes, that's the one. And this one's just a smiley face. Nice scene. Nice scene. Um, I don't know. Well, I guess something though. Something. A couple people shooting guns at each other at the beach. crazy how much better I feel now just being out of there. Well, <laughs> another successful eviction. I like that they didn't put it on the door, they put it on the mailbox. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.